Hello friends, my name is Yusupriya. I want to say the topic about unformatted input-output functions. The unformatted console input-output functions are used to read a single input from the user at console and all it also allows us to display the value in output to the user at the console and it's a single character from the user of the console without enquiring it. So the functions which are used to take input from the user without any alternation and it will print same as it is as on output screen without any changes and these functions also work with only character data type they do not require any conversion symbol for identification of data types because they work only with character data type and there is no need to convert the data so these functions are called unformatted input output functions in c++ there are four types of unformatted io operators they are get put get line write the get put functions are allowed to take a single character it do not take any string which is a group of characters and get line write functions are take a line or a sentence which is a group of characters now i will explain deeply about these functions and get put get and put are member functions of i stream and o stream classes means get is a member function of i stream class and put is a member function of o stream class for single character input and output operator mean a get is a input operator for a single character similarly the put is a output operator for single character there are two types of get functions means they we have two ways to use get function one is get character mean assigns the input character to its argument means the get function has argument of character type which assigns as a input and get void which returns the input character here we can see three ways to use a get function character c c in dot get c is equal to c in dot get here c is equal to character and put function put is used to output a line of text or character by character means put function is used to give a character type value as a output and here we have three ways of taking put function character c c out dot put x c out dot put c let me explain in deeply here the get and fun put functions are there the get function is used to take a character as the input similarly the put function is used to give a character as the output let me see void main here and character ch the character ch he is a data member in this program because the get and put functions only take character type values so we should want to take character ch as a data member so we should want to enter the character na so c out enter a character so the get functions we may have to use in two ways c in dot get ch or character is equal to c in dot get the get function is associated with the c in because the get function is a member function of i stream class which take only input data similarly the put function is also have two two ways c out dot put character or c out dot put m here m is a character value we already mentioned here we should take any character value as m o etc here the m is a character value we already mentioned so this m value is directly taken as a output on the output screen get ch so what is the output of the this program enter a character here enter the character have na enter a character and uh, suppose we take m as a character here it is the input so this m character will be get by get function because the get function is allowed a m character as a input on the output screen input on the output screen similarly what is the input m so output will be also m this output will get by put function because the put function is allowed m character as a output on the monitor screen this is about get and put functions now we will discuss about get line and write function get line function the get line function reads a whole line of text 
that ends with the new line or until the maximum limit is reached means the get line function is used to read or give input in a line which is a group of characters which ends with the new line means up to new line or up to given size and write function the write function displays the character in in the string array or display the character up to given size means the write function is used to give output in a line which is up to given size or it will take the size of the input line so the syntax for the two functions are get line variable size write variable size both syntaxes are same now i i will explain these functions deeply here the get line and write function the get line function is used to take a line or a word as a input similarly the write function is used to take a line or a word as a output let's see void main here and character name 20 here the character name 20 is a data member which the get line and write functions is only take a group of character means a string of characters so character name 20 is a data member we should want to enter the name na? so see out enter name and the get line function we have to use in two ways it has two ways to use see in dot get line name or see in dot get line name 20 here the 20 is the size of the name uh, if we do not want to mention the size we only use see in dot get line name this is the functions and similarly the write function have to use in uh, two ways it is it is also have two ways to use see out dot write name or see out dot write name 20 here the 20 is also the size of the name or we should not want we use see out dot write name so this get line function is associated with see in and write function is associated with see out and what is the output here the uh, here we have enter the name na? so enter name uh, suppose we take anil kumar as a uh, name here the anil kumar is a input which is read by the get line function the get line function will give uh, a group of character which is the name anil kumar as a input here so what is the uh, input anil kumar so similarly the output will also anil kumar so this output will be print by the write function which is a group of characters which is the si name of the size is 20 so here the anil kumar which is a character name so this is about get line and write functions thank you for watching this video from bjr tech talks